Yo, this nigga coming on what, man? Said he would if I guaranteed a parlay, and I'm here on it. Of course, he said y'all would be paying my fee rather than his own self. Your fee? I'm doing like one of the marriage counselors. Charged by the hour to tell some fool he need to bring some flowers home. Then charge another hour telling the bitch she ought to suck some cock every little once in a while. You know, keep a marriage strong like that. Speaking of cocksuckers. Don't believe we met. Proposition Joe. You ever steal from me, I kill your whole family. All right, y'all both here on my guarantee, so respect that shit and say what you feel. I'm up out of here. I got a man who said he's gonna give you a life back, yo. Who, Boxdale? My man say, tell that motherfucker that if he can find a way not to dip in our pockets, we're gonna call this shit evil. Y'all ace barely. And what you did to my boy? So y'all think after what you did to Brandon, we supposed to find some even on this, huh? Yo, I don't know shit about shit, all right? I'm just a messenger. Whatever, man. You know this dead on both sides, right? There's gonna be a whole lot more if this beef keep up. But the truth be told, there'll be more soldiers in one half than the other, you know what I'm saying? Hey, look here, son. You tell Boxer that he's been paid back for what he did to my peoples. As for his product, well, man's got to earn a living, you know? I don't know, no, what he called Boxdale, B. The man I'm talking about can't have his shit taken like that. I won't do. All right. Tell him throw me some cash, then. And we'll see. About five or 10,000. You know what I mean? For my retirement, Holmes. Five, if you can keep quiet about it. Send my money through Joe, man. How careful is Stringer Bell? I don't know no one named Boxdale. <laughs> Still, we got him tied to the Brandon killing. That could be enough for one day's work. Do what I could for y'all. 